Hilda was left alone. That was how she liked it. As soon as her mother went to bingo, Matilda walked the ten blocks to the library and devoured one book after another. Where are the children's books, please? In that room right over there. Would you like me to pick you out one with lots of pictures in it? No, thank you. I'm sure I can manage. When she finished all the children's books, she started wandering around in search of something else. Where'd all this come from? The library. The library? You've never set foot in a library. You're only four years old. Six and a half. You're four. Six and a half. If you were six and a half, you'd be in school already. I want to be in school. I told you I was supposed to start school in September. You wouldn't listen. One day you're going to have to earn your own living. It's time you learn the family business. Sit down. Write this down. Pretty soon you'll be able to do any multiplication, whether it's 2 times 7. 14. Very good. Or 13 times 379. 4,927. I beg your pardon? I think that's the answer. Is. You're a little You're a cheap. one word. It's time you started you acting stupid? like one. I'm smart. You're dumb. Yeah, I'm big. You're a little. far from the tree. I think there is something wrong I'm with right. Girl. You're wrong. Hey, and there's nothing you can book. do about it. You're a one word. It's time you started it's acting time like you started one. acting like one. Stop you. Look. She wants some snotty, disobedient kid. Because she's a spectacularly wonderful child, and I love her. Adopt me, Miss Honey. You can adopt me. And doing perhaps the first decent thing they ever did for their daughter, the Wormwood right signed the adoption uh, okay. papers. Right here. Uh, okay. Come on, come on. Come on. happiest part of the story is that Matilda and Miss Honey each got what they had always wanted, a loving family. 